Poisoned. Addressing Arizona's fentanyl crisis, new at 10, the family of a Valley teen who died of an overdose speaking tonight at a community forum. That teen's case is one that we've been following for you for weeks. ABC 15's Marissa Sarbach reporting from Pinnacle High School. Getting ready to graduate. And unfortunately, that's, that's not the case. We ended up laying him to rest on his on the day of his prom. It's been 52 days since the Ayala family changed forever. March 17th is the worst day of my life. It was at 315 that my life forever changed. It was at that time where my brother and I had found Noah. Noah was a Scottsdale senior, just 17 years old, when his parents say he bought a pill from someone he knew that he didn't know was laced with fentanyl. His siblings found him unresponsive. His parents were on their way back home when they got the call from a responding police officer. Told us to pull over and, and that's when they told us the news. And my wife got out of the car and for the next hour and a half was the worst cry I've ever heard in my life. For two months, they've been grieving, but they want to keep moving forward, alerting other families along the way to the dangers of fentanyl. Noah's family spoke to a crowd at Pinnacle High School Wednesday night at a fighting fentanyl forum. Maricopa County Attorney Rachel Mitchell moderating the event hosted by Valley nonprofit Not My Kid. The use of fentanyl in Maricopa County has exploded. For part of the event, the nonprofit is giving out different items like prescription lock boxes and even Narcan, which anyone can use if they suspect somebody is overdosing on an opioid. The Ayala family joining the voices on stage in hopes that Noah's story will be the last. I should be driving to go pick up Noah from work not driving to, with my family to go sit to visit him at the cemetery. We checked back in Wednesday with Scottsdale police for an update on the teen's case. No arrests have been made in what they've described as a death investigation. Reporting in Scottsdale, Marissa Sarbach, ABC 15, Arizona.